Come on, strats. <laughs> oh, what are they down there? Oh, oh, oh. Surely not again. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, oh, shit. <laughs> yes. Oh, this is a good fish, guys. This is a great fish. Woo. That is a monster, monster shore based queenie. My biggest yet. Oh. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to another episode. I am back out in my boat. It's early morning. I got strided down below and we're sending it out to the islands. We don't really know what we're doing today, pretty much like always, but we're going to live from the land, catch our lunch, catch our dinner. Fingers crossed we do. But I do have a little bit of an interesting challenge today. I thought I'm going to do some sort of lure challenge. So what I did is I went to the tackle shop late yesterday afternoon and I bought 10 lures. This is not a sponsored thing or anything. I just went one brand. I went Helco lures, all different shapes, sizes and colors. And what I'm going to try and do today is do a one fish next. So I want to chuck a lure around, catch a fish on that lure and then go to the next lure and then go through and see which lure gets smashed the quickest or is the most popular. And then I'll fish with that lure. I mean, 10 fish on 10 lures in one day is a pretty hard challenge, I think, personally. So hopefully I don't lose too many. Hopefully the fish are on. Hopefully the weather stays up and I can do that. It's just for fun sort of thing. And uh, yeah, check out the view at the moment, guys. It is a dead glass off. Another beautiful morning. Been so lucky lately. Um, the last couple of days have been pretty average, to tell you the truth. So I've been making the most of it around home and going for a few little missions here and there, what I could do but today looks like we are on. No real plan, so I'm sort of just gonna see what happens. If I go out there and it's clear, I'll go for a dive. Obviously I'm by myself, so there'll be no deep stuff today. Sorry, all you free divers out there. It's just not really safe to free dive any depth. Really you shouldn't be doing it. Like I don't encourage you doing it on your own anyway, but definitely not the deep stuff. Let the challenge begin. The first lure I'm gonna try is this silver and purple sticky from Helco. A Sly Dog 125. That's why I've pulled up here. I just thought I'd run you through the lures that I've got today. I've showed you the first purple little devil one. This one here is the old Helco rooster, just a popper. The red head, white body, this thing has been <laughs> around uh, since I was a grommet. I used to use these when I was a kid. The Helco roosters when I was a grommet. So it's pretty cool that they're still around. Obviously you want to use poppers to entice the bigger fish up uh, better in deep water, you know, like if there's nothing around, you use that sound to bring in fish. So drop offs and stuff like that, the fish will come straight up off the bottom and just go bang. But I mean, I'm only talking because I haven't really caught any big GTs or anything like that on a popper before. So there's guys out there that know how to fish properly that probably uh, give you better information than me, but I just do it for fun. So maybe today is my day. I need to catch a fish with this, otherwise my challenge is incomplete. And for the selection of other lures that I've bought, I'll show you. Ta-da! This is the Helco Laser Pro 190. So, I think it dives to two meters. Um, I really like this coloration. I reckon a big old Mac or something will smash that, maybe on the troll later on. Next up is this, another Laser Pro, a little bit different shape, smaller, the old Goldie. I reckon a Trevally, Queenie, Maybe a Mac, maybe even a cold trout in the shallower stuff will come up and hopefully pump that guy. Exact same, different coloration. I just thought I'd mix it up and see which one sort of gets spanked the most. Another Sly Dog, I really like the look, the weight and feel of these stickies. Like I said, I'm no expert, so I'm just trying out different things and hopefully you guys can learn a thing or two by my mistakes or what actually works. So I've got that guy in a different coloration. The old Golden Rooster, woo! I reckon this thing's gonna get smoked, hey? And then I've got another smaller one in a different coloration. So we'll see how these go. And to finish it off, I've got two slices, one gold, one silver, same size, same everything. And I really like this kind of lure. These are probably one of my favorites. So we can maybe jig them down a little bit or chuck them around on for some tuna, maybe mac tuna or something like that. Everything really eats these. These are awesome lures and they're quite cheap. Enough chit chat, let's see if we can catch a fish, eh? I'll probably catch nothing today. Oh, it is so bloody beautiful right now. Woo! 
Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh sorry, lass. Strally, want to come in? Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, that was so nice. Ah, oh, this is so good, guys. I knew it wouldn't take me long before I got so distracted from fishing. <laughs> Literally, I've been on, out of the islands for five minutes, like three casts, and I'm already just. To... <gasps> what are they? Are they trolley? <laughs> wow, man. Epic conditions. Beautiful conditions. I got something! I got something! Yes! Woohoo! Damn! Yes! Strata! Well done! Little rack! Oh! How's that? We got one on the purple little devil. The sly dog. I think it's what it's called. I can't even remember what it's called. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh. First fish of today. Little shark, Mackie. Phew. Oh. oh. Well, I made myself a little bit of a tangle here. <laughs> first fish of the day, first lure. <laughs> the sly dog got pumped by a little shark mackie. There's little teeth marks underneath there. That was uh, that was awesome. That was absolutely cool. So I will try him for now and let's put on something different. Next up in the lure challenge is the golden rooster. I really like the looks of this thing. I reckon a big trevally. Come on baby. Quick change out to the silver little slicer there. I'll save the goldie for um, when we get to the islands, maybe for a GT. Well, there's stuff swimming around the boat just below the surface that are small, so we'll try this. Yeah, it is actually beautiful right now. It is gorgeous. Holy! Ooh. Oh! 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 Maybe I should get that big trawler out, hey? Put him on the big rod and go for a bit of a troll for all this bait. It's not a bad idea. Let's get our troll on. We got this big laser pro. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Whoops. I love the looks of all that bait coming right up to five meters there. Hopefully a big Mac after him or something like that. Hey Strider, come on. <laughs> Probably one of the main reasons I started to troll around this area is because I'm looking for ground to go diving on. If I find a rock or a lump or a ledge out here in 25, there's probably big red emperor on it and that's what we're sort of looking for. So I'll just troll for another 15, 20 and see what I can find. Shaking its head a bit. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, 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 oh. oh, it's coming this way, it's coming this way. Might be a shark on its ass, guys. Oh, it's coming up. That's a yellow fin. Oh. 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 Yes. Yellow fin for dinner. I got 
That's in the soda already. Yes. The laser pro doing the damage on my dinner. I know I said one lure, one fish, and I'll swap over, but I can't help myself. I'm just going to go for a little bit more of a troll. I was literally in the water for like a couple of minutes, and that happened. So. I love yellowfin, I want to catch another one, maybe a mac, so I've got the same lure on, going for a troll. Um, only doing about five to eight knots, and uh, last week I told you guys about sea snakes on the horizon and keeping your eye. I was more talking about when you go on like 20, 30, 40 knots. Obviously you can see for 500 meters or more, and I always got one eye, so a lot of comments said that I was cleaning the back of my boat and not looking for sea snakes. Common sense guys, like, it prevails, it helps. This is a better fish, boys! Woo! Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Come on, let's come back this way. Oh, that just went off! That just went off! It's very, very sharky out here. Me and the boys dive this ground a fair bit, so I'm always cautious of sharks. So trying to get them into the boat as quick as possible. Hopefully this is another yellow. Ah, oh, another fin! I'm gonna keep this guy, two yellow fin. That's lunch, dinner for me and the crew tonight. So, I don't need any more fish today. And how good's that? Early morning and I've got my quota for what I need today. We love yellow fin. I can't wait to cook this up. Give some away to Jacko, Sam, Hannah. i tell you what, this fella is doing some serious damage at the moment. It's gonna be hard to beat this for my favorite. Some epic shit's gotta go down the rest of the day for this to be beaten. Oh, hello. Oh, oh, that's the one. Oh, looky. Oh, okay. Okay. This did the damage, man. This is, this is an awesome lure. No doubt about it for trolling like that. I've got eight more lures to try catch fish on and the day's been so fun already. Got myself a feed. <sighs> you bloody beauty. Let's go, let's see what else we can get. Mackie. I've got to be really careful here because the hooks are tiny on this little slicer. <laughs> Look at that. Got him. He's actually been chomped by another bigger fish or a shark. <laughs> He's been in, in someone's mouth. Look at it. Look at that on this side here. See all that? Down the bottom there, but he's in the water. See ya, mate. There's, an, there's something right there. What is that? What is that? Is that another fish right? Surely not. Let's see how the little gold diver goes. First cast. Not as much weight in the cast as the other lures, but you could troll this, you could do whatever. So hopefully the shine gets them in. On! First cast! On! Oh my god! Oh my god! First cast! First bloody cast! Oh! 
We got a Queenie on. Queenie on, guys. First cast. Just gotta watch those rocks up there. Those well coming. Oh, oh, oh! oh. We just got the boat in reverse because there's rocks up here and I don't want to hit them. Wow, it's actually a big, good size queenie. I've just got him. Oh, I've just got him. I might lose this, guys. Oh, I just got him. Hold on. Oh, no. Hold on, no. Let me come. Wow, the fishing's been unreal so far. First cast, see those spines on the top there? You do not want to get one of them in your hands, so be careful. See you, mate. Oh, this fishing today is red hot. I've swapped my lure out, and I might put a rooster on. Put that golden rooster on and see if we can stir up a GT or a Trevally or another Queenie or something while we're around this island. Unbelievable. I I'm having so much fun, guys. Just go across the... Uh Reef Insane hit. I hope I got that on GoPro. That was a big fish. It missed the lure. There's not even a teeth marks on it. Oh, that was just wow. I got a lot of lures to go through, so I'm gonna count that big hit as a half a point. Half a point for the big silvery. So I'll put him away for now. Uh, that got a fish, didn't it? Yeah, that got a fish. And I might go, I'm gonna chuck this fella on. Another sly dog, just a bit of different colorations. I reckon it's gonna get absolutely slammed by whatever that was, big Trevally or a big Queenie, I think. So let's chuck him on and go for a flick. Okay, first cast on the, uh, what's it called again? The sly dog there. I really love the weight of these for casting. They absolutely just yeet. This wind's starting to come up a little bit, but I just punched to a new island. This is probably as far as I'm gonna go. And first yeet out here, see if we can get something. Just pulled up to shore. Me and Strider are gonna go for a swim, and I reckon I'm gonna swim in the rod and the lure and see if I can get another victim from the shore on that lure. You, you never know, and it's, you know, it's the fishing challenge today, so I'm really, I'm going with it today, crew. Ah! Come on, strikes! <laughs> oh, this is gorgeous, guys. This is absolutely beautiful. Woo! Oh, Strider. Wow. Check it out. Paradise, baby. Oh, what are they down there? Oh, oh, oh. Is that fish? Look, look, look out there. What is that? Oh, Queen! 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 Come look, 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 look. Oh, no. Oh, no, no. Oh! Shut up! <laughs> Talk about sight casting this then. Queenies, a big long tongue. I mean, I did pretty well not to hook one then. That was, no, I don't know. I got excited, but that was some sick hookups right on the beautiful beach right here. Right in front of Strider there. Oh, I'm very remote right now. This is a pretty long way from home to do a day trip, but lucky enough for Genesis to hook us up. And you guys supporting me, I can put fuel in my boat and come out here. Thank you guys so much. Oh, I see some more. What's this? Oh yeah, here we go. Here we go. 
Corn, here we go. Corn, corn, corn. Here it is, here it is, here it is. Oh. What is going on here? Surely not again. Surely not again. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh shit! Oh! 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 School of big, big queenies pushed in just then. Oh, I'm getting worked. Just put that guy through there. Oh, come back. Come back here. <laughs> yes. Woo! Oh, these are good sized fish. These are. Oh, oh, he's jumping. These are good sized fish. <laughs> yes, Strider. Woo! Oh, this is a good fish, guys. This is a great fish. Oh no, my GoPro's about to die. Don't die on me. Don't die on me, please. Oh. Oh. oh, I'm gonna have to stop this and get it when it comes close because I'm gonna run out of battery. I'll see you guys when it's in. Look at the size of this queenie. This thing is huge. Oh, Strider, we on. <laughs> oh, what the hell? Woo. Oh, oh, we did it. I'll quickly get the hooks out of him. Guys, that is a monster, monster shore base queenie. My biggest yet. Oh, let's get him back in the drink. Yes! <laughs> Look! There it is! Oh, thank you, mate. Oh, 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 I'm so happy. That was so much fun. Thank you, GoPro, for hanging in there. You're on like 0%. Oh, there you go for a swim. Oh, this is the good stuff. Woo! Oh, you're kidding me. Look. Look right there. I'm swimming to the boat and there's a whole school of trally right there. They just swam up just to tease me. You can stay there, Strata. Look at right there. Oh, the buggers. Oh, they're coming back at me. Can you guys see that? Oh, oh, this is just going nuts today. There's just fish everywhere. I need to get myself another lure and swim back to the boat. There's a, there's a bloody queenie right there. Oh my God, look. Ah. Look, Queenie, right there. Trevelli just gone back that way. Look, there's a Queenie at my feet. They're hungry. This is, yeah, what the hell? Going with two options. I don't have too many options left. Today's been insane. This fella and this fella, I'm feeling a top water hit. I'm feeling the popper at the moment. I want to see this thing get absolutely roosted. Oh, the shark, oh, the shark, oh, the shark. Shark! Oh! Oh! This shark! That shark just hit my popper! There's two huge sharks out there, Strider, don't go anywhere. Oh, it's floating, the popper's floating out there. The popper's floating, but the sharks are hot. Oh, they're, they're angry. See the popper just out there? That's a huge shark behind them! Strider, get in there! Oh! Look, there's fish hitting the popper. I don't know if I should risk it, because they are angry. But the popper's just floating out there. Oh, shit. Here we go. Here we go. GoPro's probably going to die as I'm doing... Oh, I just... What the... Oh, I just did a spin! Okay. 
Uh, we have to swim to the boat. I need to get Strider because I don't want her to swim to the boat. She oh, this is an interesting situation. That's psycho. These sharks are going psycho at the moment. Strider, you stay there. Stay there. Oh my god. This is going to be interesting. If the GoPro cuts out... Oh, no, I can see it. If the GoPro cuts out, it's uh, the SD's full up. But she's going to cut out as soon as that shark approaches me. You stay there. Oh, this is insane. I love this shit. My heart's actually... Ah, oh, slow my heart down a bit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, shit. It's coming down the beach. <laughs> I don't know if you're... <laughs> oh, I knew it was going to cut out. For those that don't believe me, SD full. That scenario, you just can't script that. That shark come within about 10 meters from me, 15 meters, and you just piss bolted that way. Like it was spooked when it seen me. We got hearts going, there's still fish everywhere. Oh. So I'll replace this SD card with a freshie that I got in there. And uh, we might chuck that other lure on and see if we can um, catch a fish. <laughs> those sharks were crazy. I've never seen a shark come out of the out of the water like that for a popper and actually hit it and then the big one just did start doing big spins and stuff man my adrenaline's going this is crazy let's let's get back out there you gotta be shitting me oh my god this is what she does she's just as dumb as her dad uh, the sharks are gone now but come on <laughs> come on man take my eye off you for five seconds i told you to stay you are crazy. You like those sharks, don't you? You got really excited, didn't you? Good girl. Come on, up you get. <clears throat> Come on, swing your butt around. You know what's up. Naughty, I told you to stay. Mmm, yes. No, you didn't. Come on then, in you get. Maybe we'll do some fishing just from the boat. Look, there's a fish right there. Big fish, oh, it might be another shark. The, the little blue rooster has been retired, lost at sea. Oh, that hook's bent out. Look at that. That's from that big queenie. Wow. Um, anyway, we're going to go this little laser, purple and silver. See if this thing can get spanked. I'm sure it will. It's just red hot at the moment. I don't think I can do anything wrong. Well, I mean, I am me and I suck at fishing, so probably can do something wrong. I see a fish. Oh yeah, we're on. We're on! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Those little lasers, if there's fish around, oh, 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 oh! Whoa! If there's fish around, they instantly turn and go straight at that lure. And that coloration is awesome. I'm not too sure what this is. I actually sightseeing this. I could see it in the distance. I'm pretty sure it's a good sized little trev. But uh, we'll bring him in for a closer look, hey? Oh, there's sharks on it! There's sharks on it! Dana, get the shark! Nice! Get out of it, you cheeky, chesty little bastard! Oh my god. I'm so sorry, mate. I'm so sorry, mate. That reefy was literally just chewing on its tail, the bugger. It was too small to uh, eat it. Oh, sometimes sharks are such little pests. This poor Trevelli, I don't think, I don't think it's done any damage. Oh. Not too bad. I mean, a lot of fish do survive from this kind of thing. Yeah. Yes! <laughs> oh, you little play of beauty. You are very tough, mate. Good luck growing big and strong. Those wounds will heal. And then there were two. We've got two left of a challenge I thought was gonna be actually impossible to do in one day. Somehow we've done eight out of the 10, seven and a half. Uh, later on, if everything goes to plan, I'll try that golden uh, popper again. We've got the little gold slug. 
which I think will get smoked probably even at the back of the boat here. And then this fella's gonna be the hardest, I reckon. I'm gonna have to find quite a big fish to, uh, what is that? There's a big shadow coming. <laughs> How good's this, guys? Don't judge me. Oh, it's quite big. It's big. It's big. Oh! Yes! Oh! Big Queenie! Oh! On the golden slicer going off at the back! Oh! There's a whole heap of Javali with it. Oh, this is the time to get my popper out. Jump, it's gonna jump again. It's gonna go. Oh. 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 Another beautiful queenie on the golden slug. Get him in the drink. Where's that Javali? Oh. Nine out of ten, that one big rooster to go. I just need a big hit on it or a take or whatever. I just need something to hit it and I'm gonna call this challenge complete. But I'm about two hours from home. It's 2.30 right now. So I'm gonna start steaming back towards home. It's a big punch home. Even though it's beautiful weather, I'll be sitting on 30, 35 knots. Hopefully, fingers crossed that wind's not too bad back in towards land. Um, I'm gonna stop off on some more islands on the way home, a couple of casts of that big old rooster. And uh, man, this has honestly been one of the funnest days fishing I've had in ages. So glad I decided to do that lure challenge. It, it just added another whole element of just mixing up the lures and stuff. We've got a feed of yellowfin. Man, I'll recap. I think when we get back towards shore this afternoon, I'll go through my lure box and recap. We'll try and remember what we caught on it. New Island, this is my last attempt on the rooster probably, unless something epic happens on the punch back home. Couple of casts here, and then we're hitting it. I'm calling it guys, fishing challenge is over. Nine out of 10, well, almost nine and a half out of 10, which is pretty good. Oh, it was a uh, man, what an amazing day. I didn't actually think it was gonna turn out like that. Like, when I set myself this challenge, I was like, no way I can do this in a day, but I almost did. The fishing just turned on. Some good ocean karma out here today, ladies and gentlemen. Um, it's still pretty nice, but that, uh, that breeze is coming in and I have a long way to go, so I'm gonna start punching back now. About halfway back now, that wind is just starting to feather in a bit strong now, so I'm just closing up the cabin up the front here, and we'll start steaming home, surely, but a little bit slowly. Uh, it's all good. Ah, oh, what a day. How you doing, Strider? How you doing? You going good? Yes. <laughs> Jacko's just coming down to meet me at the ramp to give me a hand putting the, putting the boat back on and I'll see you guys back at my house. Do some cleaning, some filleting and yellowfin tuna for dinner tonight and I'm actually that excited about that. I can't wait for that. So I'll see you guys back at mine in a little bit. One, two, three, go. Yeah. Yes! Well done, boys. Woo! <laughs> We've made it home. It was a long trip home for Strider. She was a little bit sick by the end of it. Pretty bumpy. But uh, we got to get that fish out and get cleaning, hey? Get a couple of slabs off. I am starving. 
I've hardly eaten at all today. I didn't really bring anything with me. I had a little bit of breakfast in the morning. So your boy is hungry, low on energy, but I had one of the funnest days ever. Got him. Dunno. Bring it up. What are you trying to do? Just feeling it pop the way. Oh, Brody Moss. Not bad. Yes, I did it. I left a bit on there. A bit for Strider. You should try some of that. Yeah, actually, I should eat some of this, huh? Been cold the whole time. Has been cold the whole time. Look at that. He's good. Whoa, hey, Bob. Don't! <laughs> <laughs> You're such a. Really skin, that's good. That'll be delicious. Should get some sauce or something out of there. It's crazy how tuna has. That tastes good. Beautiful couple of fillets there. Thank you very much. Get off, fly. Yes. Thank you. See you, mate. Look good? Oh yeah, that looks good. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Hello everyone, just come and grab their slice of tuna. This is all that's left. A bit for me tonight. Fresh, it's, it's always best eating fresh fish, man. So I've got this, and because the shop is shut, I just got what I packed in the boat today. So I was gonna cook these today on the boat. So I've just got a burrito mix. So it's gonna be burrito tuna. So it's gonna be tuna burritos tonight. Tuna tacos, baby. Um, the green shit and all that good stuff. Woo! We got fire, baby. Not as good as those kids at the jetty today. They absolutely nailed it. Shout out to you guys. Um, I actually am fading away here, guys. Like, I haven't eaten in so long. I'm starting to get a little bit delirious, so... I probably won't film too much of this. I'm just going to get straight into it. Just going to season this with this. Chuck that in there. Boom. Um, I'll run you through the lures um, from today when I'm eating this feed because I really need to feed myself before I <laughs> pass away. Most people like their tuna a bit raw in the middle. I like to cook the tuna all the way through. I just like that texture that it has um, all the way cooked. So it's really up to you guys. I know people out there be like, what the hell are you doing with the tuna? But same as like my, if I rarely eat red meat anymore but when I do I like mine like well done I don't really I don't know why I just just like that big shout out to the cleaning fairy who come today and clean my house thank you so much <laughs> fish is done people are always telling me in the comments and stuff that I should fry these before I eat them so wow okay I like this I like the cook wrap there you go guys that's probably a pretty advanced wrap for Brody Moss. Oh, you're shitting me. Oh. Wow. That brings me to my favorite lure of the day. This fella right here. I mean, if I, I only trolled around for 20 minutes, got three fish on it and then gave up, but I could have trolled all day with this thing. It swam good, and obviously the fish bloody loved it. Look how many teeth marks are on it. It got smashed. Really like that. Obviously good for your pelagics, mackies, tuna. You, you troll up a big GT or something with that as well. Um, great, great lure. I am definitely putting that back in the boat. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Least favorite of the day, this fella here. Uh, it's hard to catch fish on big poppers, but those big queenies were tailing it and just wouldn't wouldn't bite. So this is my least favorite of the day. <laughs> These two slide dogs, wicked lures.
Absolutely awesome. A bit weighty, which is awesome for launching them. Big old yeets into the breeze or whatever. They swim so good for stick baits. Some of the stick baits go on the surface and go all weird, but they stay just below, sometimes come up. And they got smashed. There was fish around, they just turned their heads and it was on. This one really had trouble hooking um, onto fish, but it's probably because I bent the hook on that first exchange that I had, which I didn't realize. So really good lures as well. These two fellas, for a little bit of below the surface, uh, like the fish reacted to these the quickest. I don't know whether it's the, uh, the bearings in there and the noise and the vibration, which it could be, but as soon as these hit the deck and they started swimming, I watched the queenies and the trevallies just turn their heads straight away and smash it within seconds. So another great addition. Would have been good to get a couple of reef fish on these, but I ran out of time. Like go and target uh, coral trout, cods or flags or something like that. They probably would have got absolutely peppered. This fella, I think it might have been a big GT that had a crack at it and just like bumped it with its bloody big old head and missed the hook. So that went quite well. Trevally obviously loved these guys and so did the sharks apparently. Because uh, rest in peace, the other little fella that I had of them, gone. And then probably one of my favorites, they're cheap. You can drop them, they just catch anything. Small, big, whatever. The old slugs, the gold and silver. Both went really good today. Don't know the difference in the colorations today, but the fish were on. So there you have it guys. The lure challenge, that was really fun. Leave a comment below, like this, subscribe if you haven't yet, turn the bell on for notifications, and I'll see you guys in a couple of days. Thank you so much for everything. Cheers. Uh.